evil. Thank you. That's a prayer. Uh-huh. So thou shalt keep them from the evil is... That's another good one. Because if God is... But it's... Is God keeping all his believers from evil? No. True. So now that's, an- that's another failed prayer. But I don't see it as a prayer. This whole you, thing you is... You even said the word prayer. <laughs> This is what Paul prayed. Well, well, what is prayer? Is prayer not talking okay, to the okay, Father? Okay, all right, all right. I can see that okay. he is praying to God. Gotcha. Hmm. But I don't concede that they were not answered because we are not all of his followers, even though his followers are in the world. We are not all, everybody is not him. They're his followers, even though some of them claim to be. Lots of people follow him and you don't even know who they are. They just do their own thing. Yeah, but he praying that his followers will be perfectly one in unity. So do, do we see this in the world? Yes. You see that in the world today? No, it's not today, but I do see what he he is saying it is not in the world today and it is um i believe it's mostly because people don't understand really what he was saying in the first place yeah because he spoke in cryptic language i mean yes he, he did he yes he uh-huh. did yes he did but there was a reason for that and the reason for that was so that in the end times it would make sense. You would be able to make sense out of it. So, um, to be as one with him, you have to know who you are. You have to know who your father is, who God is, who, who God's, who his father was. And there are people who do know that. But then there's plenty of people that don't. Hmm. Yeah, what we clearly don't see is 40,000 40, different denominations. Yeah, so that is true. We clearly don't see a perfect That unit. they are not all together. And like I said, it's because they don't understand um, what the word means because it was not really for man to understand. But if the Holy Spirit, they had a Holy Spirit, he's supposed to be guiding them into all truth. The Holy Spirit does guide them into all truth. So why are they divided over the same truth? I can't speak to which truth they are divided against. For instance, I believe that the Holy Spirit is given to us all, but the Holy Ghost is completely different. So... So you're saying the Spirit is different from a ghost? Yes. Uh, the Holy Ghost is different from the Holy Spirit. What is a ghost? A ghost comes from dead people, right? Um, Dead, or right. And God is a God of the living, so it's... He's the God of the living. Why is he sending ghosts? Um... That's what it's called. It's called a Father, Son, and Holy ghost but if you realized what the word meaning starting with male and female made he them you would understand that the mother and daughters are also holy hostesses ghostesses or goddesses it's an equal thing which you have a male and you have a female you have a son and you have a daughter but for some reason men do not see the um the female portion of God's face. I believe that as in heaven, so in earth, the God parent of Jesus is female. She is both our father and mother. She is one in the same. But the word father is means different from the word male. You can't be a father, even if you are a male, without a female that makes you a father or makes 
or gives you a son or a daughter. So your father and mother are one and they're one in the same except for just female. Jesus couldn't tell us that then and he couldn't tell us that now. And he said you had to wait. You couldn't bear to hear that part yet. So now you're hearing it. Lots of people are in the last days and they will finally hear the truth. They don't even believe I exist because they never added the and female portion or honor thy father and mother portion or that it is for this cause the man, meaning Jesus, is to lead his father and his mother. Doesn't say that they're two people like we have two people. They're both one in the same. It's his father and his mother to cleave unto wow. his wife. And the two shall that. be one flesh. Are you saying God, God, is, you saying God is a trans? <laughs> no. I'm a saying woman, this whole woman. time, God has been our mother. She has been our comforter. She has been our provider, our source. And we never think of that because <clears throat> Jesus said, this is how you pray, our Father who art in heaven. But everywhere else, where you see father, you see mother. Honor thy father and thy mother, not mm -hmm. one over the because other. Because it's talking about human beings in the earth. It's Which talking about with... Jesus, it's talking about human beings, no, it's I think talking it's about clear. animals, it's talking I think about it's very all clear that flesh. the scripture about marriage is talking about a male and a female. I think that's pretty clear. Yeah, and so is Revelation well, 19, about... 7 through 9, but people say that it's, it's oh, well, that's not a real person. It is a real person. Just like, the, like I said, the Holy Ghost is actually a real person. 